Okay. Right then. Let's just wait and see. We good? Are we good? Yes, we are. Cool. Right then, slightly earlier than planned. Um, let's have a go. Evening, Liam. Hello. How are you doing? Not too bad, thanks. How are you? I'm doing good. Doing good. Right then, I need to just up this sound a bit. And then we should be good to go. If you want to speak for a minute. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, four, three. Two, one. <laughs> yep, yeah, that's good. Yep, yeah, that's good. Sweet. Right then. So, good evening, guys. My name is Alpha Racing Man. Welcome to the Hub of Racing. And welcome to a brand new season of excitement coming this season. Not only that, we have got another season of Jenkins Cup. We have got the rookies coming involved as now with the Stanley Cup. Now, I, as you can see here, this is the Stanley Cup. Uh, fixtures now we have got seven people in the league and I've completely forgot here is Liam Jenkins as well even in Liam I sorry I forgot to introduce you <laughs> how dare you no it's fine now again good to be back and I'm really excited for this new format we've got definitely definitely like I said we've got seven people I've, uh, what's happening with Tom as well Liam uh, he's around his friends at the moment, and oh. for some reason they won't let me get in the server. So depend, well, like in the account because I'm already logged in. Okay. <laughs> so unless I try and get into Internet Explorer and log in with his details, and classic Jenkins is team to a dramatic failure tonight. <laughs> I think it's best to kind of let him fail in his own ways. And I'm not actually done my setup yet, just because it's meant to be raining, and at the I moment the it's same. meant to be sunny at the moment. So. Um, but you know, it'll be interesting to see what happens. Uh, guys in the comments, uh, even in Liam, even in Tim, uh, even in Barney, feels so good to watch my first IGP race where there's no pressure on my team. <laughs> there is pressure on mine, surely. I don't think I'm going to be doing well today. Um, again, even in Tim, even in Spets, uh, Liam, enjoying Grid 2, Tom. I am, actually. I'm slowly getting into it. The first couple of races, which I'm going to have... I've got an own, like, little mini-series that go into my head. You know, just generally, uh... You know, just just giving you, like, a short race or a long race and just throwing in a heart when you can just watch without commentary. So, I've got an idea coming. The first one should be up tomorrow. Uh, but I am enjoying Grid 2. I'm looking forward to playing it on PC, though, because that's where uh, i got my serial one, so I can try it out. Um, even in Dominic, uh, even in Alex, even Keeper, even, even in Dino, wow, we're getting loads of people in here already. Um, we should be able to spectate to a word, I hope. Yes, we can. Right, Sandy Cup is ready to be spectate, Liam, if you want to, uh, get ready. Right, how do I find it? So that's IGP, IGP spectate. Oh, spectate, okay. And then you just click on the Sandy Cup. No, nope, that's not right. You click on the actual race. And we can tell uh, the qualifying results as well. Um, is, oh, there it is. Uh, Spets mainly racing Pinks Cup will blind the opposition. Mm, okay. Barney, we'll have to wait till the 24th of June for Grid 2 because it's my birthday. Oh, cool. That's ages away, though. Anyway, uh, that's even a long way. Fun, yeah, I'll probably be starting my uh, let's play anyway. So you know, uh, Liam, I'm watching Sandy Cup of 2D for every three. I'm only getting this up, guys, uh, because I think one uh, we got one team already got the premium account, so that's really good. Uh, all the other guys can watch it through here and be able to tell what is going to be going on. But for qualifying, as uh, the race is about to get underway very soon, Aimlow Motorsport is number one. Boss is two. Uh, Freeze Cook, Manly, uh, Many Racing 4th, Ainlo in 5th, Rami in 6th, Rami in 7th, Fadino in 8th, Cook Racing in 9th, uh, Luigi 10th and 11th, uh, Dino in 12th and Manly Racing in 13th. But you got to say, top 10 separated by 2nd. That is great to see. Loving Especially that for already. a Junior League as well. And there's three, three cars with um, Kers already. 
Yes, uh, you've got Boss in there, you've got Tim in there as well, so, you know, it'll be interesting to see what happens as I'm, I'm now getting the uh, Skypes before. Uh, not for now, Tim, not for now. Maybe, maybe tomorrow I need to, I need to speak about Liam. Uh, and Tim's saying, can he be co-commentator? <laughs> <laughs> we could do that, get a co-commentator for the, uh, certainly Cup. I, I, well, think about it tomorrow. Tomorrow will be easier, so um, we can get that sorted. So we can have a go. Right, we, let's load up the 2D viewer. Let's see what is going to happen. Oh man, I'm excited already. I'm going to be. Are there still probably more successful teams in the um, junior league than there is in my one? It's going <laughs> to. They're all going to score points, and I'll still be the only team not to score a point. <laughs> right. Um, we don't really need that much information, so hopefully you can all see the weather. Oh, we're already on the way. Wow, that was quick. This is strange, not actually doing anything. So the race is on the way for the first ever round of the Stanley Cup. Uh, I need to expand my time and screen a little bit, not more. There we go. So 13 cars in. We've got uh, Truop and Kadim making a move here. Uh, we've got we've got Boss with the first teams of Curbs. Um, oh dear god. <laughs> um, so who's on the way? I think this is Aim Low is still in the lead with no curves at the moment. Let's see what he can do. Uh, we have got all the guys on soft tyres and we've got one guy on Inters. Well, it's only cloudy at the moment, isn't it? I know, and Rydell has actually just made a pass from someone on Inters. Well, that bright be... pink car could be blinding the cart in front of him, you never know. Um, that so look, Dominic, I made a blog post about the Jenkins Cup excitement. Really? Ooh! Send me the link! That'd send be me, awesome! Send me the link! That'd be sweet to have a look at that, but anyway, it uh, looks like uh, Aim Low is still in the lead. He's uh, about half a second quicker than Boss in second, but the advantage for Boss here, he has got curves available to him, as now I'm getting more... <laughs> you need to get Java. You need to get Java to. Right, across the first start finish line we go and aim low is still in the lead, followed by Boss in second place, followed by Manly Racing in third and in fourth. Then you got Campbell in Frammy Racing in fifth place. Then you have got Cook Racing in sixth and then you got Rydell of Manly Racing still with intermediates. Um, still in front of uh, five other guys on soft tyres. He's doing well considering he is in eighth place. Um, let's look at the comments. Uh, Tom, I have two drivers that I'm happy about and one driver ready to sign. Don't know what to do. Uh, just see what happens. Uh, Tim, I may actually rehire the driver that I wanted to get rid of. <laughs> um, Dominic, I would like some sometimes. Co uh, I would like to sometimes co-commentate again. It's more of a report on my practice and pre-race and I'll also put a link to you your video once the video is actually finished. Oh cool, no problem Dom, it'll be interesting to read actually. Um, I'm getting sidetracked already. So we've still got, uh, by the looks of things, aim low of 12 and 11. Still leading with Boss, still in second place, but they're kind of averaging the times. Well, I'm second, the second that Manly cars are going the quickest in sector 2. Um, the first car was the quickest in sector one, so it'll be interesting to see who will work their tyres hardest. Um, looks like we have got, I think, uh, Frammy Racing using their tyres quite viciously here, and Valdai's tyres. I still can't believe uh, Rydal is still in eighth place with these worn-out Inters. He's not doing too bad at all. I mean, he's got a little bit of a train behind him, but... Oh, no. It's not wearing that much quicker than a soft. He's just four seconds slower than the leader, but... It's, in terms of degrading, it's not that much. And if the weather's going to be, like you said, predicting rain, it may not be a bad idea to start on the inters. I mean, if there's guys that are, you know, maybe not going to be fighting for points, and you know that, like, for me, for instance, maybe an idea if mm. I'm not going to be fighting for points anyway, if it does rain, it's not going to be the worst idea in the world, I suppose. Yeah. It's so cloudy at the moment, there's no rain, there's no water on track, so you know, it's just interesting. He's still doing personal best, I've got to admit, he's still doing personal best for his driver. He's just, he's now, he's just lost a position now to uh, Wilson. Um, I believe that is in Dino's car. Yeah, Dino racing. Um, so you know, let's see what happens now. We've got uh, Boss. Is that Boss? Yeah, Boss is 
getting a line, still doing personal best, he's quicker than the car in front, so he's catching them ever so slightly. Um, the guy I need to sight last as well? Really? Wow, he did really well then. Um, but he's going to be overtaken ever so slightly soon, so you know, we've just got to wait out for that. As we go on to the fourth lap, I believe now. Uh, yep, fourth lap out of 14. And i got to make sure not to get too carried away because I still need to do my setup for the Jenkins Cup. Oh, just thinking that. <laughs> I'm going to wait till I get mine in. And um, so, yeah, it's still quite a battle's going on. You've got now the Inters. Now, right there, was just, just lost two places uh, coming into that first corner there. So now he's outside the top 10. He's a really start pitting. But Bice has just done the fastest lap of the race of 26.17. Uh, half a second quicker than the car in front and he went four temps faster in that first sector alone um, you know it's still kind of going well Tim is doing well up there in fifth and sixth um, you know this will be oh I'm loving this already oh, you've got like two little so. battles two little battles you've got like the battle for first um, way probably down to about sixth and then you've got battle from seventh um as we get uh, Liam, have you got grid? Oh, my phone won't stop talking to me, so sorry for that if you can hear it in the background. <laughs> have you got grid, the original one? Uh, on what console? Xbox. I did, and I oh. don't know. <laughs> oh, okay. I shame. can't, this is, this is, did I tell you about my phone that is kind of broken? How, how is it broken? Um, it's on silent, but every email or text message I get, yep. it reads out the name of the person and a bit of the message. Okay. And I had to take it off the shop floor at work the other day because it started reading things out. And customers even are getting annoyed. Is there a woman in your pocket? What, even on silent? It's on completely silent. There's no voice control in it or anything. It just keeps reading things out and I don't know what's going on. That's why I keep hearing like, for no email from, and it's getting really creepy and weird. <laughs> It's like the new connector, you can read your heartbeat, only this phone, and it's <laughs> creeping me out. <laughs> uh, has Liam... Oh, why has gone in the pits and gone on hubs? Hmm. He was on Inters, weren't he? Yeah, he was. Yeah. Not a bad so call, So he's gone for a massively long second stint. Um, he said also, this is speeds in a chat, he said, Simon on Inters wasn't a tactical decision, I just forgot to change. Fair enough. <laughs> Oh, we were just typing it up like he's trying to play the risk game yeah. here, but we can pretend he is just for this moment. It's a classic Jenkins, and thank you, Anthony, for subscribing as well, if you are in the stream. Um, it's 300.61.blogposts.com, 300 uh, Liam, for the link. Let's oh, hello, look. we've got um, Aim Low in the pits, first place in the pits. Uh, he's got to switch the hards, ain't he? Well, I don't got, know. I mean, those tyres aren't to. really that it's bad, not even are they? Halfway, so I, yeah, hard tyres. Yeah. Oh, you got both of Frammy in here as well. No, I think Tom that this is going to be quite crucial for us. Looking at this stream, I, the guys in the big league can—it's almost like F1 drivers watching GP2. You can mm. see what the tyre wears like, what the best decision will be. I mean, right now, it's looking at hard tyres may be the way to go. Well, we will see now, as both of Frammy's cars are on hard tyres. You just saw, I think, uh, Aim Low. I've got to get used to these team uh, names now in here. So Aim Low is uh, the first guy or the leading pack who have, who was the first to pit, and now he's on hard tyres. So we've got to just watch his progress to see how quick he can get past um, like the train from fourth downwards. I still can't believe that's... Like, what five cars within a second of each other and it's gonna be interesting because hardly any of these guys have got like curves or drs so you know it's all gonna come down to as i think boss here is losing time against the other aim low motorsports cars lost a second yeah a second and a half in that middle sector alone he has not pushed those tires no. whatsoever I think Boss will have to pit soon, surely. As you've got also uh, Wilson in the Manly Racing site to catch up very slowly. But you've still got this train here from Wilson with the two Luigi cars. So you've got Dino and the two Luigis still battling it out here. No one's entering the pits just yet. Uh, Framis has moved up position and took over uh, Cook Racing. 
Uh, and Liam, how's your friends joined? Uh, he hasn't, no. He said he'll be joining after tonight, so he'll be in for tomorrow's race. Okay. But uh, it's a shame, really, cause I, but then I, in the same way, I'm not biased. Like, come on, come on. Then. <laughs> um, right then, so... Oh, I'm loving this already. <laughs> I'm loving this already. Um, but what is it? This like boss is using curds now, but still. Um, the... Oh. Aim low, isn't it? I keep... Yes, Aim Low Motorsport is still with him in second place. He's not letting him go, is he, at all? No. And he's gone for... Well, last time round was quicker, but yeah, he's lost a bit of time there to the second sector. But he only, he only lost that time because Boss was using his uh, curves. So, with pace, he's got pure pace. He's only two attempts off and he weren't even using curves. He hasn't even got it. It looks like he's going to be overtaking him on the main stretch. Or, or maybe not. He's already overtook him. But now he's coming into the pits. Boss, Ooh. you've got to pit, man. You've got to pit this lap. Majorly. He's in the pits Is now. Maybe don't try and go. Well, to be fair, he did get a fastest. Oh, he it's still a bit slow. He had well. a fastest second sector. With curves. Well. But now, for me... Looking at those times, you, you can make those soft tyres last. Yes, you can do a soft, soft in this race. As Manly is coming out in front of his teammate. He's jumped his teammate, everyone. That's really well done from him. Um, both of Wilson's, both of Dino's cars coming out. I think they're going to end up behind Frammy here. Yes, they are. As uh, Frammy just overtook Cook Racing in the number five machine. Um, so out in front at the moment, we have got a lonely boss uh, out in front but he's losing he's going to be losing time 30.6 in the first sector for him second place of uh, luigi did a 30.1 and then he got 32.8 but he's just came out the pit so he's losing half a second he's got to be pitting this lap to have any chance of actually getting an advantage here the times are looking decent the for hard tires are doing a 30.6 so, you know, they're still doing well the hards, but I think the soft soft is the way to go, especially in the Jenkins Cup. I think a lot of cars will be going on to that. Um, a 28 sits from Boss in the middle sector. Uh, Luigi comes through and does a 28 free. So, lost 0.3 of a second as Boss finally enters the pits to actually get into the bits and probably go put another set of soft tyres. And he should be able to push a little bit earlier, but it'll be very close to see where he comes out. I think it's going to come out um, just behind the number four car um, in seventh place I'd say that's a pretty good bet and you've have got a Luigi coming in you have got also Cook Racing coming in is that his boss did pretty well is that he only lost one position actually so pretty good there from boss and the car in front is on uh, soft tyres but he's got curbs as well so you can catch up in a later stage of the race uh, Frammy Race is still going well, he's in 5th and 7th and sixth at the moment, so they're guaranteed if he doesn't do any classic Jenkins in here. You have got the Luigi comes out in front of Dino, the same with his Zitsa car out in front of Luigi as well. You've got, oh, everyone has pit now, so R. Williams has came out of the pits to take uh, 11th place. You have also got Manly Racing down in 12th place, didn't really work out with the hard tyres, but... You never know, you could probably push really hard, you may get some points coming out of it. And then you've got Cook Racing at the back of the pack. But the race is on now for first and second. And there may be a battle here for third and fourth. Um, uh, Dominic is saying, I was already on Soft Soft, just so uh, it doesn't seem I'm copying someone. I think there's going to be a lot of copying now with this uh, GP2 stuff, I reckon now, Liam. I find I'm quite interested with this. I kind of feel like uh, a bit of team I was just watching on trying to steal some tactics and we could see like a little scapegoat theme here. I don't really see it's it's too much sneaking around now in this league. It's really getting a bit cheeky with tactics and people teaming up, but I don't like it. It's we, don't, we don't want any tie gate situation right here. <laughs> and speaking about Oh you know but it's, it's the pro Oh go ahead. As yeah, long as these tyres last longer than the Pirellis like we saw last season and it, like, some races they were amazing and held up for like 9-10 laps at some cases and others they're like after about 3 they're just completely gone. Hmm. And speaking about tyres, my latest video, uh, my new series came out today, they called the pit stop. Talking about the tyre gate between uh, Mercedes and Pirelli, if you haven't checked that out guys feel free, it's a cheeky little plug I know but 
brand new series talking about F1 news and you know if you could go ahead after the stream or during the stream and check it out in between the interval then feel free guys it's only a five minute video so it's an easy watch um, during that race or during that lap as well uh, I think of Rami racing at Bont 26-1-4 for the fastest lap at the race um, the leaders are still out there doing 29-7s uh, it looks like uh, Boss is slowly catching up only by about three tenths of a second third and fourth are at the same pace there about Rami is doing about there about two tenths between each other you have got Dino coming through the second set now doing a 27 nine so it's pretty quick there and then you got uh I think Luigi and then Cook as well so you know be very interesting indeed uh even in Dream uh and even in Harrison even in Dre <laughs> Glad to see you in the stream. He's maybe trying to scout, yeah, scout a couple of things. What could be to come in the future if he decides to join and check out the competition. Yeah, um, but yeah, very nice to j uh, see you joining in, Dre. Um, this is the Stanley Cup. This is for the rookies uh, just batting it out here. So uh, it's a little fat battle here for Aim Low and Boss Racing. Boss Racing's got the advantage. When I say that, he does a second quicker lap in the first set. Does 25-2-5. In the first set to alone, he's still got about a quarter of his curves left in the bag. So can we see Boss get in the position here by his wearing out his tyres a lot quicker than uh, aim low? But then also you got a little bit about here at the bottom as well in for third place. 27-5, two temps faster in the second set to for Boss. Four laps remaining, about to come down to three laps as we go and cross the start finish line. Any after there's two corners coming up. Oh, the guys behind are slowly catching up as well. Most of the field are doing about a 27-7. So great to see the top sets are really competitive, even with some teams haven't got curves. So that's really good. Boss has got DRS coming across the start finish line. He was half a second quicker in the final set to come into the first corner. Can Boss take it? No, he cannot. Only just behind here. So it will be very interesting to see. Uh, CJ, even if CJ Ferrari had a tyre test with Pirelli between Bahrain and Spain, same situation between Mercedes. Really? I did not hear about that at all. Um, Dominic, I watched it. I heard the controversy is that the teams must use a car for tyre tests at two years and Mercedes using this age one. Yeah, but then you can count, kind of counter argument saying about that if you use a two year old, uh, two year old car, then you will have trouble getting the actual results to pinpoint accuracy or what they want it to bring. So you know, using the current car I mean, the is always good. So much. Hmm. I'm saying the cars have evolved so much, and it's like Red Bull and Ferrari were the main ones complaining about the tyres. So then Pirelli try and improve them, and then they can. I don't get it. I mean, it's fair enough that they're gonna feel a bit outdone by the fact that Mercedes won the race, but. I don't know, if they want the tyres to be better overall, then it could be their saving grace in a way. Yeah, definitely. Be careful what you wish for, is the same thing. <laughs> yeah. Apparently Ferrari did a test of full Pirelli as well, but I have no idea where that information came from either. So, don't know really. We'll have to see what happens. As we've got two laps remaining, Boss is still within DRS reins. He has fallen off the pace a bit. He lost three temps in that, in that lap, lap alone. So... As uh, I'm doing my setup uh, very, very late, uh, I need to try and keep... Oh, I've done one yet! <laughs> uh, so I'm trying to get my setup done, hopefully. Let's go with that. Right, let's... Oh, I'm updating Olivia. I thought Olivia change would help, not take forever. <laughs> Right, both of Family Racing okay, using right. their curbs. Uh, boss is losing time now. He's overworked them tyres again. Um, so this will be interesting to see as I need to save and copy pretty much all these values over. Sorry guys, if it's going to be a bit of time, but I need to do my setup. <laughs> so I can't see the chat for now. I will get to that any moment. Yeah, I'm literally just sweating my setup right now. I'm just mashing like the test button as quick as I can. <laughs> right, what's happening? Coming on to the final lap soon now. 
Oh wow, this setup is pretty going well actually. Uh, coming on to the final lap, uh, Aim Low is still leading the race. Boss is still in second position. Then you have got another car of Aim Low in third place. Then you have got Manly racing in fourth. Then Frammy slowly catching up to him. Can he get a last minute lunge on the last lap? Maybe, possibly. Then we've got Luigi just behind Dino racing in the car number one and ninth. Aiming for eighth place. Uh, oh sweet, that is a setup I'm worthy of. Um, I just set that out loud, didn't I? <laughs> um, right, okay. I need to figure out strategy now. Uh, it's gonna be right. So I was thinking strategy. Now it's gonna be quite interesting with the fuel load. Mm, yeah. Oh, how would you put it in first then? I'm working. Because I always out, get this I'm wrong. Working like out the moment. Moment. I'm working that out at the moment. So that in 26.6, so I'm gonna put 29 and 29 each way, just to go halfway on both. Oh, we got retirements. Yeah. We got retirements. Fammy, Fammy ran out of fuel. Tim, no. Classic it Jenkins. No, Fammy, no Tim. He's lost out on a great position to get some decent points, but that is horrible. So everyone will melt two places. As Aimlo finishes the race in first place for Aimlo Motorsports. There you got Boss in second. Aimlo again in third place. And then we have got Manly Racing. I saw the fourth place for him. And then we have got Dino. But we have got Dino and Luigi firing it out for sixth place now. Some decent points here if he can manage to get in front of it. So let's see what will happen into the coming up to the final corner now. Will Luigi be able to pass? Dino, will he? Won't he? I have no idea. There's no DRS, so there's no easy pass. No, he keeps hold of it at the end there. Rydell gets a oh, really good result starting on intermediates in 8th place. Then you have got uh, Luigi again and Cook Racing coming home in ninth and 10th. And then you have got uh, Cook Racing, the, other, the final Cook Racing, just outside the points. So, what an explosive start. That was pretty tense to say the least, wasn't it? Was Explosive start. <laughs> we'll have to go through the um, the sands in a bit. There you go, the race is finished. Well done to all the guys in the Junior League. And well done to Aim Low for the first and third. And also to Boss in second place. Getting the fastest lap also with 24 7 8. Um, so, with that is done, we can go back to the field. And hopefully we can take a look at the results. I haven't actually came through yet. Uh, they have now, or one point. Okay, points are loading up. Right, I need to go catch up with the comments now, guys. Uh, Dream says, evening, Dre, the man, the myth, the legend has arrived. Clap. Oh, thanks. No clapping from me. Um, <laughs> Liam, rather use a 2010 car instead of use a 2013 car. Oh, okay, I see why. Uh, Dino, looks like the good battle for the final point. It was. Uh, so the only thing I know for sure that is no one knows for sure on these tyres. Um, but we relate to it. And CJ says, I can't remember, but I know for all use a 2010 or 2011 car. Dino, being classic Jenkins moment. Oh, yes. Um, <laughs> Um, Dominic, I think Mercedes deserved that win since they have the pace, but the tyres work quickly. But now the car, the cards were dealt the way that was, but got power. And Mercedes deserved that win. I admit, I admit they deserved that win. Um, but you know, it, I think they've changed the tyres now, so they're going to testing out those tyres in practice and bringing different tyres. Um, so that's brilliant to know that that will be happening. So, you know, we will see what happens. Um, Oh, thank you, Dream. Clap for Tom. Thank you. Um, Dominic, Tom, Perez, Raikkonen thoughts. Oh, God. Um, my thoughts on this Perez, Raikkonen thing is, because I, I'm a McLaren fan, so I should be really biased against Raikkonen now, but for me, Perez was too aggressive, in my opinion. It was great seeing him overtake, but it was a bit too aggressive. To say and Raikkonen, well, everyone knows what Kimi's like. He's always called that uh, he doesn't take any uh, rubbish from anyone. So you know, I I think 
they're both to blame. Perez was a little bit of aggressive with other moves as well to Alonso and also to Button. Um, but I think he's trying to make his mark at McLaren, trying to make sure that uh, you know they want to keep him uh, for next season, and they're not. He's not just like a one-year golden boy, and in the nets he's just slow. Um, what are your thoughts on that, Liam? Actually, Perez and Raikkonen at Monaco. I've always liked Perez, and I think he's got a lot of talent, and he's just one of those like raw rookie things. And it's like kind of when Hamilton started out, and he was making not so much rookie errors, but you could tell he was a rookie driver. Mm. I know it's Perez's second season, and he's got kind of big boots to fill, and Hamilton's gone. And I think he's just trying to push too hard at the moment, and the car's not there, so he's pushing harder. And he just got to get that kind of rookie driving that he's carried over from Sauber and iron it out into a more mature driving style like Button has. And I mean. Yeah, Raikkonen balances the two very well, and he's quite aggressive when he wants to be, but he can defend quite well, and, but he's respectful, and I think that's what I like about Kimi, but Perez just needs to kind of iron it out a bit, kind of not let all the adrenaline get to his head before trying to make a move that's probably not going to pay off unless the other driver has to back out drastically like we saw, mm. and I don't know, I'll see how he goes in the next couple of races, but he's certainly, I reckon give it four or five years, and he's, there's no reason why he can't be fighting for a Constructors' Championship. Yeah, but that's the thing. Does McLaren have the time and patience to put him through a four or five years at McLaren to try and get the potential? That's the thing. McLaren want to start winning races, and with this Honda deal, um, they're going to be probably looking to try and make it more a revival in that. And talking about engines as well, Williams and Mercedes. Have you heard the news about Williams? Uh, oh, uh, Williams using Mercedes yes. engines. Is that from next year? Or yes, is this, yeah, from next, next year. Was it, yeah. Yeah. Which is very interesting. Um, I'm, I, I weren't expecting that. I thought they were going to keep with the Renault engine. Seems that they're not doing really that well. Unless it's more money-wise. Um, and Mercedes is slightly cheaper. Um, but you know, Mercedes looks to have a, a decent engine. But with Honda coming in. Honda's also looking for anyone who wants to take up on the deal engine deal. So you know, we'll find out eventually soon. Um... Odd oh, has got two perfect setups. Damn you, Odd. Uh, Sibrin, ha hello, have I missed anything? You've just missed the ending to the Sandy Cup and the results. I haven't got the actual final results because it's just weird like that. So I will take you through the sandings for the Sandy Cup. So you have got uh, A. Ackerson on aim low. Gets 40 points of that first race. Really good points scoring in uh, the opening round. Then you have got tie for second. Boss racing and Dino racing both with 18 points then you've got Manly racing with 16 points only two behind uh, and then you've got Luigi with eight Cook with one and Frammy unfortunately both with a double retirement of a classic Jenkins moment of running out of fuel with zero points um, but now that is that this is now we have got f two minutes before our league, the Jenkins Cup, the big boys turns to come in and see what they can do. You have got two minutes left to get your setups and strategy locked into place. Even in rapid, welcome to the stream, uh, Perez. Oh, not Perez, a dream. Yeah, Perez is, get, is getting a bit too aggressive. Uh, Dominic, uh, Perez tried to streams where he had no space. I respect all drivers, but some of the moves were stupid. I would have, I would have had more respect from him if he didn't blame Kimmy. Why would, he, why would it be his fault? Um, I guess kind of see why he's going to it because in the breaking zone he was moving over, and if you kind of take it in the point of um, you know, of an old incident of it between Senna and Pross, Pross kind of did the same move uh, in Japan, and moving over. If Kimi did that, would he have made the corner? I don't know. It'll be interesting to see what happens. Um, Perez, per, uh, Perez went for a gap that a car could fit down and Kimi Streisman gets the barrier. Yep. Uh, Perez is trying too hard to press McLaren and his wild moves are doing exactly the opposite. Kimi clawing at that one point was pretty impressive though. Yeah, it was actually. Even though one of the moves was a Williams or Bottas just moving out the way completely thinking he was, uh, um, the le leaders were coming through. Um, Spet. Uh, Spes, for Cindy will sign with Honda, they will have technology deal with McLaren, that's a really good point. Um, so, but at least I didn't miss a Jenkins cut, ready for some more classic Jenkins moment. Well, you missed Tim have a double retirement with Fuel um, in the Stanley Cup, so you know. Classic Jenkins moments in the Stanley Cup, what can you say? Um, so, we're 19 people, really? Oh, we've really got 19, wow, 19 people. 
Thank that's you. a lot of cars. <laughs> Thank you, guys. That, I think that's the most we've ever had in the stream. Is that Liam? I think it is. I think it's going to be all at once, I think, yeah. Yeah, that's amazing. Thank you, guys. Thank you so, so much. I just said this new junior league's working. Yeah. <laughs> See, we don't need Jenkins Cup. Just keep it the junior league. We've done Aww. that, guys. Now. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I just have my own cup of me and just me, so we got my two drivers so I can finally score points. <laughs> uh, fit minutes. Might even have some songs ready for today as well. Uh, have some 15 minutes left. Well, we've got about 10 minutes now left uh, to the actual race gets underway. You've got about 20 seconds before the setup actually lots into placing qualifying is taking place. Uh, this is Alex to not you, Liam, Liam Atkins, uh, if, if he is American. Oh, to me? Or, oh, that no, wasn't me, was it? No, it's through Atkins. No. And I've just, got, I was I've just got the news uh, people as well. So, you know, uh, thank you for that. Um, we've got 20 people? No. Don't say that. Don't, don't. No, we've still got 19 people. Well, that's a thing's on mine. Uh, Dominic, if Kenny tried to avoid collisions, he would have cut the chicane and should have let Perez through anyway. So he did what he thought was best. Yeah, classic Kimmy. He doesn't want a, a slower team passing him, especially if it's a rookie coming to that team. So, you know. Um, what else? Uh, Liam is actually Welsh. Okay. Oh, wow. There uh, you go. See? Dream. Hi, Tom. I'll update my team pick. I will have a look at that very quick. Uh, rapid play for Rapid Scorpion GP can pull together a good points haul in the season opener. Dino, Liam, hope you can score some points. My, uh, Alex, my YouTube flag extension says he is. Um, so that's I think the ooh, the one thing that I was kind of getting out of this league now is I've become more of a sympathy team. <laughs> uh, and it's just, I Aww. started off quite strong, you know, midfield finishes, getting points occasionally, and it's just deteriorated. And people are like, "Come on, Liam, you can still do it. We have got you. Come on, a little bit more. Maybe next time." Seventeen races later, come on, <laughs> come on. Uh, Liam just says, "Wales for the win." <laughs> <laughs> and I love I loved Yoshi's uh, Island's new logo as well. <laughs> Kitty! <laughs> brilliant, brilliant. Anyway, um, I've got a message as well. Who's that from? That's my I've, phone talking I've to me again. I've been gifted reward points. Oh, I got 10 points from Barney. You didn't have to do that, Barney. Oh, thank you anyway. <laughs> right, the setup, setup is locked. Qualifying is in place. Um, as Dominic has says, funny thought, Kimmy commented on Team Rodeo, that idiot is going to hit him, referring to Perez. <laughs> <laughs> well, did, did Kimmy also say after the race that I want to punch him in the face? Most probably, that's such a Kimmy thing to say. <laughs> yeah. Um, Alex, is it worth the money for the 2D and other stuff? Um, uh, I'd say it is I at the moment, it depends. If you're getting involved in like we are, and we're using it every week, then I... I think it is because then you, you know, the stream's always behind. So if you want to be on top and, you know, be on top and trying to alter it and have the full timing stream, have, you know, just the map in general, you can. But you know, it it just depends if you go keep on uh, going ahead and that. Um. But yeah, it's it's up to you in the end. If you, it depends how much enjoyment you're gonna get. Um, I'm thinking about also doing another giveaway. Um, at the end of this season for another two. Uh, a 2D pack, but I will, the way I have to do that is that I have to give you the money from to pay to your, to a PayPal account, and then you have to buy it yourself because there's no way you can actually buy it and gift it to someone, which is kind of weird. I have said that to him. Can you try and implement it? And they go, I think they go try and have a look into it. Um. Oh yes, I forgot about that, Liam. Sorry, my mind. I'm just in chill mode now. Uni's done for the year. Um. <laughs> so, right, we're just waiting for qualifying to be done, and it is done. Here we go, guys. Oh, judgment day. Here we go. Right. I think I want to look. Wow, wow, rapid is up. Ten! Where am I? Whoa, Scott! Whoa! No, whoa, whoa. What? Whoa, 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 no. Don't say about that. Look at the top 24 cars are separated by a second. Oh, my God. Oh, I can't bear the tension. Let's let's have a look then at Jesus. the uh, qualifying results for the first round of the Jenkins Cup. You got Rapid Scorpion 
first what? place there with Rosberg. Then you got Keep Racing IGP, which I think is odd in second place. Then you got Rob in third place. Then you got Yossi in fourth and fifth. Falcon in sixth. Rapid Scorpion again in seventh. Falcon in eighth. Muslimitz in ninth. No leeches in tenth. Well done, Liam. Three tenths off the pace, but so close in the top ten. Uh, on, mate. in eleventh. Yeah. BCP twelfth. Alice in thirteenth. Uh, Fifteenth place reserved racing. Please change the name. In 14th. He's not 15th. He's 14th. LJ in 15th. <laughs> Red Rock in 16th. Me in 17th. Uh, Red Rock in 18th. Uh, me again in 19th. Full throttle in 20th. Adam to win in 21st. Keep racing IGP in 22nd. No leaders 23rd. Full throttle 24th. Alex in 25th. Harrison 26th. 15th place reserve race in 27th. Adam to win 28th. LJ in 29th. Overly man, man in 30th. And Harrison brings up the rear in 31st. But to be quite honest, 24 cars... Um, 1.6. What? Yeah. Well, 24 cars, 1.3. Or well, Harrison, 20. Well, the whole field is separated by 1.6 seconds. That's ridiculous. That. I mean, I think, as I say, every year is getting more competitive. The first year was like oh. Rob dominating us, and then we got a bit closer, and then closer, and now it's just like next season we separated by a tenth of a second <laughs> the entire field. <laughs> oh man, I, I love this guys. See, the junior is excited, but this is even more exciting. I mean, look, the top four guys are separated by less than a tenth. Less than a tenth for the top four guys, and it's four four different teams. Crazy. Absolutely crazy. Um, Liam, how hard I'm not reading the comment there. I know, I don't want to bring that back up. Harrison, 27th and 31st, the brew up back crying. I don't want to do that, Harrison, you're new here. Uh, Dominic, that's really good considering how bad my car is. Take a look at the blog anyway. I will do in a bit. Uh, even in Rob, he's in uh, goalkeeper, my internet decided to mess up the stream totally. Uh, Rapid Scorpion, back to Carl Edwards style. Yes, get in there, pole. Um, Keeper saying, good. God damn, still no poll. Uh, Dream says, lower. oh no, one of my objectives is going to be damn hard. Oh well, loads of comments coming in. Uh, well, quick announcement, I will be live controlling tonight. Uh, Liam, Alex, I registered this account where I got my phone, so I don't know what phone I did it on. Uh, Rob said, don't be scared, Liam, I will keep dominating. Um, <laughs> Dom at qualified world, Rob's car is confident. Rapid said, wouldn't like Hartford to quite higher up, but Jan was, but you won the full German P1. Alex, point four off, good job. Uh, Dominic said, I would lose a race in, one, in a one mag league. Oh man, I'm loving this, guys. I'm loving this new layout. I absolutely am loving it. Right, I gotta get fifth and sixth, or better, to get my objectives. And I'm down in 17th and 19th. Any, I don't get anything, my objectives. Anything can happen. Like I keep saying, over over the league, anything can happen. And what are your objectives? Well, Abe starts 10th. He's yep. got to finish better than 17th. Yeah, that's like, Easy. great, that's achievable. Well, maybe. Kind of. Maybe. Carlson's got to finish 14th and he starts 23rd. Uh, it's taken from last race results as such. Ah, right. So that's why um, it kind of peats and that, so... But, you know, 24 cars, 1.1 1. 1 second. Mind blown. Absolutely mind blown. I'm loving it. Absolutely loving it. Thank you guys as well. Thank you for being so great and still continuing this IGP League. It's fantastic to see more people. And I'm going to tweet that out <laughs> with the link as well. Right. If I can type and spell. <laughs> Was it twenty six? Uh I think so, yeah. Right, that is tweeted out. Um, let's go back to the comments here. Uh, uh, Scott, I love my objective to still to finish higher than 16th and 17th. Hmm, does think that may just be doable? 
I think so as well, Scott. I, I believe <laughs> so. I don't know why. I, I think that is doable. Um, what else? Uh, Spears, we've hit 20 people. Oh, wow, we are. Yeah, we've hit 20 people, guys. Thank you. I think we have some for free tweeting that as well. Um, bit more than two hours until grid. Also, yeah, two hours, 11 p.m. it comes out as well on Steam. Have you pre-ordered it on Steam, Liam? Or are you getting on an Xbox? I still, I've literally been, I'm in an RNF to get it at all. I'm not sure if I'd <laughs> play it. Because I want to get it on PC. But with my wheel being broken and demised at the moment, I'm not sure if I want to buy it on a controller, then PC as well. Mm. Don't know. I would get I would get on PC because you pop, you could probably get a connect your Xbox to it, so you could still use the pad to an extent. But you never That's know. Yeah, I don't know. I'll wait and see. I've got a few hours to decide. Okay. Um, but yeah, we've got 20 viewers in the stream, guys. Thank you so much. Uh, the first half t hard runner is Kenderson in 22nd, and we will see what will happen in the first round of the Jenkins Cup as we are going racing now. Off we go. Loads of teams are on soft tyres. We've got one, two, three cars on hard tyres as we are making some moves here. Uh, I need to just push as hard as I can. I'm down in 15th and 21st at the moment. It's going to be so... Look how close it is. Oh, my. That is crazy. Go on, um, A, B, A. Scott, if Jan somehow wins, I will actually physically explode with happiness. <laughs> Don't make oh, you mess. never know, he's Don't got a little bit of a gap. Uh, rapid, let's go toward gentlemen. <laughs> we will soon see about that. As well as we're still, look, look at the front pack, they're slowly getting away. You've got like the top four guys starting to get away, and then you've got, oh, top three guys getting away. Oh, I think that is Jan, Odd, and Rob. Um, and then you've got Yoshi bringing up a train here. Um, my Spears, my objective in Stanley Cup was to finish. That's always the way with new guys. Um, they just need to finish the actual race. I'm still down in 16th and uh, 21st, which isn't the best, really. Um, I'm still, I'm, it's hard now because there's so many names. It's so close. There's a, it's fourth down to 21st, and then you got 22nd down to 31st. That is just crazy. Uh, Harrison, let's do this, fellas. Oh, we're going to go down. First lap complete. Rosberg still leads the race with Odd and Scott. Or oh, oh, not Scott. Odd and Rob right behind each other. Then you've got a massive gap. Fourth all the way down to about 21st position here. As this is just going to get crazy very, very quickly. Hoffman's making a move here in ninth place. Takes over uh, Becker, I believe. But you've got a few oh. teams here. Has it curves? Oh, sorry, Liam, I did interrupt you, eh? I think I'm going to get a new driver next race. Really? Well, Carlson has not performed all season. Where is, well, last year, did he? Where is he Carlson? He was never inside the top... Tw he's 25th. I've never seen him inside really? the top 20. I swear. <laughs> he's just aims a one-man band at the moment, and he's not doing too badly at all. I think he just needs a bit of support. Some saying, Becker, what happened? Becker hasn't done anything wrong. It's just... Everyone's has just jumped at the opportunity of how badly this has gone. Top three are still getting away, and then you got like a little bit of a, a little bit of a gap here. Um, <laughs> Liam getting a, so getting a new driver might sign his old one. Chloe overtakes Fitzgibbon. That's good to see. Um, but you know, look, 13th place, fastest middle sector. And oh, DRS this lap as well. Yes, DRS is now active on this Can lap. Uh, you yeah, got it out in front of me, Liam. Hoffman does the fastest last sector with 28.4. Hoffman is using a muzzlement, so... You know, top three are still close, but... Uh, Thomas, pick it up, man. It's not Thomas. It's Tom. <laughs> it's Tom. Uh, rapid, I'm going to have to be careful. Uh, lest my leg starts to twitch, Christian Horner style. <laughs> I can't do anything. I'm pushing. I'm pushing hard with these tyres. I ca I'm not. I can't do anything. Those are t some people are starting to use the tyres a bit more than others at the moment, though. 
Um, Hacker's done 29.9, the leader's doing 29 fours. Uh, That's my driver. Oh, okay. I thought you were talking to me, Alex. Sorry. <laughs> oh, it's too tense. I can't this deal with it. This I, is tense. Like, I've never been this silent in a broadcast before, ever. <laughs> I'm just... Heavy for God, Phil. <laughs> it's just there's so much to take in. <laughs> I know, the, how close it was and people may do a soft hard. I don't think I've... I can't risk it. It's too tense. Not when I'm this far forward. It's too tense between, I think, the hard tyres. People, all right, we're going to have a lot of DRS party here now. Look at the DRS train on the back stretch, on the soft finish stretch there as we go on to the fourth of 14 oh, wow. laps. Rosberg does the fastest number, 25.64. Um, you have got Rob's, Rob's car down, 25.78. Uh, Dom's car, or Odd's car even, a 26.4. Then you got a 26 flat from Peterson. Then a 26.13 from fifth place of Rob's car yet again, I believe. Um... I'll tell you what, Tom. Yes. Hards aren't looking too bad at all. There's guys on hards doing. I mean, Jurassic Johnson's doing a 127.7. Who's the fastest hards? And that's hards? not that far off the pace. Who's the fastest hards? Hendrickson, 28.1. There's about three... So there's a 20... Seven. Yeah. Two 27.7s I can see. And then 28.1. 28.1. Yeah, 27.7, but you got to get the, the tyres up and very uh, close, though. Yeah. you got to get them up. The temps are very, very quick. Um, my soft tyres are down to about just under 70% now, and some people are going pretty quick still. So, you know, it'll be close, it'll be very close. Uh, I love how we had GP2, and this is F1, and it's still so close. It's just like the real thing. Um, <laughs> Rosberg does the fastest first and second sector. 29.3, 27.5, three tenths faster, and a tenth faster in the, in the beginning sector. Johnson is on 83%. Is Johnson on hard, so? Yeah. Yes, he's on 93%, so it's about halfway, isn't it? So they're doing about 4%. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's well. Oh, hello. Oh, two, God. Cars, two cars in the pits. We have got both Red Rock machines switching to the hard tyres. So they're going to have some clean air in front of them, but they're going to be quite close together. So is that a good thing? Is that a bad thing? We will soon see. Becker's going up tonight for IC here. But we've got to make sure where these uh, Red Rock cars come out in front because they were looking quick. Pretty much I think looking now quick. it's it's just tyre con conservation now, isn't it? Yeah. I mean, I've gone... This is the first time I've ever gone to um, take it easy because we're lap five and the tyres are going down so quickly. I don't want to risk it. I've only got literally two laps of fuel left. The thing is that so I think Odd and Wobbs, uh, second and third, are losing time. Look at Yoshi. He's really closing the gap by about 2.2 of a second. Put about 0.4 of a second now. He's closing up to Odd. I can see Odd losing time here. Unless he'll be pitting soon. Uh, well, my, my, my drivers are 14th and 16th. You know, this is how close it is now. Anyone could be at problems here with strategy. As Yoshi's right behind the Odd's car here. Will Odd we not go. get DRS? Odd doesn't get DRS on Rob. So Yoshi will overtake to get third position. There we go, third position. Then Yoshi in uh, fifth position is just behind Odd. So we will see as uh, both of Dom's cars are in the pits. You've got Hoffman in the pits. You have also got a uh, 15th place reserved in the pits. You've also got LGA in the pits as well. But can Red Rock get past any of these cars? As these cars are on hard tyres, but they will take some time. Will Odd get... Will Nah, I'm getting confused now. Will Red Rock be able to pass any of them? No, he will not. Peterson, Yoshi gets... Oh, A did the fastest time now until Ruiz got rid of him. Oh, my uh, God. It's, it's going... It, I'm, it's, I'm going it's just going out of proportion. My head can't keep up with what is going on, guys. Um, There's so many people going quickly. I know. And like Fitzgibbons has done a 28-3. Loads of people being overtaken as well. 28-5 now. The leaders are about 29 pace. 27-2, here from Yoshi. 28, 27s, 28s, 27s again. Atkins doing quicker. 26 sits. Chloe's done a 27 flat. Really? Wow, that's quick. Chloe, come on, move up. I'm in 10th and 12th at the moment. Uh, we can't, am I 8 and 7? 
Oh, 11th and uh, 12th now. I've just been passed by Thomas. Uh, Rob is in the pits. You have also got Keep Racing in the pits of... Uh, I believe that is odd. Um, we have got both of the full throttle machines in the pits as well. Uh, both of uh, Red Rock here are using curves at the back. Dom is uh, using a bit of curves now, but he will probably jump all these packs. But it looks like Rob is just going front. Or well, just behind Adam to win here. Um, loads of people still switching to hard tyres though. They're surely halfway, so surely you should be able to actually um, be able to race on the soft tyres. But we will see on this lap. No one is really doing personal best now. They're all kind of separating into a 29.5 at such. Uh, Hacken's doing 29.9. Same with Chloe. You've got uh, Yossi overtaking the second place here. Or is that... Um, I don't know. Yossi's both battling out. Um... Man Cave, even in Man Cave, how it's going, I'm doing good, thank you. Uh, Harrison, this tire talk is amazingly familiar. <laughs> yep. Come on, Abe, I've never been this high before. Where's Abe? Wow. Fourth. Really? Wow, Liam. I don't know what he's doing, but... <sighs> oh, I need a strategy. <coughs> oh, oh we're pitting, okay. Pass. I think I may have left it a bit late though, it's the only thing, I've left it way okay. too late. Okay, we have got Rapid in the pits, we've got one of Yossi's in the pits, we have now got uh, you in the pits as well, so everyone's pitting now at roughly the same time. Um, Alex just keeps on going, Yossi keeps on going, you've got Keep Racing is going on, but he's on hards and has not pitted yet, so he's doing pretty well now. He's going to move up to third effectively. Uh, all these guys coming through, can I get in front? of Dom, I can I get in front of Red Rock, I will have to wait and see as we are both in the pits, people are leaving the pit rates now, can we get in front of Full Throttle, I think we can, very close on the pit entry, uh, looks like Dominic actually jumped Rob and actually jumped uh, one of, um, nearly about to take over Yoshi now, so this will be interesting to see, uh, I'm down in 21st and 22nd position as Keith in full place does the fastest last set now the fastest first sector on the set of hard tires a 28 one oh man i need to get a few drinks next time because my throat is really hurting now i can i, I can see why you have throat trouble liam <laughs> <laughs> it's just i can't bear this i'm down to i think i've messed Are it up i'm down, down to 14. 14th place but we've got one two three four five six seven eight nine ten people yet to pit so they've still got time uh, to make a position. I think uh, Where's Rosberg? Rosberg is uh, the fastest. He's oh, leading he's of the pits. He's in sixth position. Uh, Keith, Keith, oh, Keith is going quick now in fourth place uh, of Alex. And I think he's just used all his curves. As Yoshi is in the pits as well. And um, we've also got Alex in. We've got Keith racing in. Oh, Keith carries on to that lap. This will surely give him the fastest lap of the race so far of a 122.7. Wow, that is mega from him. On hards as well. Yossi on hard tyres as well. Well done, Liam. Um, really good spot there. I completely forgot about that. Uh, more cars are pitting in. It looks like uh, over many men is up into 8th place. Uh, how is uh, Harrison doing? I would like to know. Jim, uh, Yossi is on soft tyres. I have no idea. Abe, hey, you can still get some points, actually. There's still another five cars yet to pit. I'm hoping so, but... I'm hoping I have to put enough fuel in the car. I've got 23 litres left. Hmm. Be interesting. Is this Harrison at the back? Oh, Harrison is in 30th and 31st. Well done, Harrison. You just finished the race and get some points. What? Fuel? I think I'm two litres short. Uh, O'Keefe has not pitted yet. Scott. The top two have not pitted, so Johnson and O'Keefe have not pitted. Same with Garcia and Sith. Uh, uh, Grissison has not, Cushion has not as well, but they'll be pitting very, very soon, I believe. Those are people using curves. It's like a party going on at a backstretch up here. And will O'Keefe pit? No, he will not. Um, Barney's saying classic Jenkins for Liam, maybe. Um, I don't know, oh, it's... How Becker's much have you got left, guys? Is that Becker's in the pit? Oh, Adam's in the pits now. Uh, we have got five laps remaining. Five times four is 24, isn't it? No, 20! Yeah, 20 laps. I've got exactly 20, you've oh. got to be joking. What's your fuel oh. consumption? I should have enough. What's Barely, but I'm in seven. 
Oh. Seventh. Oh, wow. Could this be your first points? You've still got two people still need to pit. You've got Johnson still needs to pit. And you've got O'Keefe still out there still needed to pick. Um, I did a 123.8. Wow. Really? How the hell? What? Wow. <laughs> <laughs> you Zulu warrior. <laughs> Uh, second, Rob does a 29 flat, personal best of him. All the other cars around him are doing 29 threes. You've got Johnson doing a 30.5, so he's losing time majorly. Uh, what is happening with my team? Not a 29 foot three, 29 five. I'll sub this. I've got five laps. I'm just pushing as much as I can. Where is the points? The points is where Alex is in 10th place. And I am only just there, so there's a possibility of me doing well. Looks like Abe there in the 24 car is using a bit of curves. Cheeky bit here and there. <laughs> it's Jan. Jan. All right. You got O'Keefe in the pits, guys. O'Keefe is in the pits. Going to be switching, of course, the soft tyres. Let's hack him over Tate Palmer. So 17th and 18th for both of my drivers. I need to try and gain suit position. I think Johnson is in also in 8th place. Where would Alex feed out, though? This will be the question. He'll be outside the top 10 for sure as go on to lap 11 out of 14 as O'Keefe yeah okay so does that fastest lap uh, what's Abe doing 24-4 fasting on the car ahead Liam and I can't deal with this that's of Yoshi you're in fifth place at the moment I don't know how this it's is, too scary this is the fin now will you make it to the finish I've, I've got six uh, literally it is like going down in four litres per time <laughs> Oh, I don't know. Well, how many laps is there left? Five or four? Four laps remaining. Four. Hmm. I might just try and hold position now because I've got what? That's you're six, the, seven, eight, center. nine. You're in the centre between Yoshi and Dom's car. I but could just try and maintain just points. Make, just put maintain or hold the position. You'll be probably going a lot faster that way. My tyres are going quite quickly as well. That's quite scary, actually. Oh, I've never been this quiet before, ever. <laughs> this is... I'm just sat here, like, with my hand in my mouth, oh, just breaking Jen's my face. Fun. Jen's in front of Scott. He's now took the lead, but Rob will get a DRS on this lap. You he's now using curbs. Um, <laughs> oh, man. It, this is... It's, so much is going on. Becker. Becker is the last remaining points. Look at the battle for Becker for the last remaining points. There are five cars in fold with also Scott's other, other car there. Um, I think Odd now is just past it. Keep racing with a uh, tenth place. So the battle there is going strong. We'll be interested to see what will happen um, in between all that battle. Was we've got three laps remaining now. Um, oh God, this is tense. Jan is uh, Jan and Rob are still doing decent times, but Yoshi's the one's got to be careful of him third. 28-8, and then you got Yoshi's other car in a 28-9. Uh, Abe is doing well, surprisingly, in the 29-5 <laughs> with, with Rob's other car with 29-4. Then you got a 29-8 and 29-5. 30-28-7s here from 10th and 11th. I think that is odd and also dumb. Uh, Dino in the chat saying, go on, Liam. Um, so, you know, uh, I think he's closing up on you, though. Oh, he's starting to close up, Liam. That's what I'm scared of. I just want point. I don't care if it's just a single point. If I get a point, I'll be happy. My, just, my please don't take this from me. My tyres are cut. I don't think I'll be able to get any points now. Look at look how close though Rob is to Scott here. Rob has got DRS. Will Scott be able to hold it off? I don't think so, as Rob passes... Uh, Scott's car into the first corner. Yoshi's catching up. Two laps remaining. Can Yoshi pull the unthinkable and pass both of the cars to take the lead? Look how close the number three car is between Rob and Scott. This is going to be a photo finish for sure as both of the full throttle cars are back into the pits. Can Harrison beat full throttle? Let's see. Full throttle coming out the pits. Harrison's coming across the south press. And can he? He is in front. Harrison is in front of one of the full throttle cars. Harrison can go home proud if he can stay in front. Two laps remaining. You're both with Yossi's cars. Are starting to catch up a first and second. Yossi does a 29 flat. 
Uh, 29 flat as well for Rob and Scott. Down to 29 for I think his tyres are starting to be cut now. Uh, Rob's got the advantage of having hard tyres. Uh, it looks like I'm being overtaken by Alex as well, which I believe I have just got passed by O'Keefe in the number 22 car. I'm going to be losing another position at this right here. Oh my god, I need some drink right now. <laughs> Oh, I think Rob's slowly starting to get away. Yoshi is right behind of uh, Scott's car right here. I don't think Scott will have DRS, but Yoshi will definitely have DRS as he is going to easily pass Scott on to the final lap now. Rob is leading the way here as uh, Scott is defenseless. Can he be taken off the podium with his other, with Yoshi's other car closing in right behind him? We will soon see about that. Uh, we are coming on to the final lap, uh, Dominic doesn't like the train behind his driver as we have got a uh, 15th place reserved in the pits as well. Can Harrison be able to take another, po another position away from 15th place here? As Yossi oh did get past uh, Rosberg here, so that's second and third for Yossi, great comeback. Harrison's also in the pits, oh no Harrison, no! Oh man, I feel for him. <laughs> I really do feel for him. 15th and 16th. Abe is still in 5th. I don't uh, know how! Have you got any music ready? Yes! <laughs> you have got music ready, okay. 20! Come on! Ah. Yossi is in 2nd and 3rd. He will hold that. Rob will take 1st. Coming into the final few corners. How is Abe is still in fifth place? Which is unbelievable. Just Lil curse, just curse it, curse Lil it to the line. Oh, Come on. Good. Come on. There's no risks. Just curse to the line. Right, here we go. Final corner. Rob will take the opening round of the Jenkins Cup. Round one goes to him. Yossi does well with a two-three. Scott doesn't get his first win. Finishing in full place. Abe comes across the line in fifth place. Yes! 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 Finishes in yes! fifth place points top five finish and so many points ages I go oh, <laughs> that possibly could be true as the rest of the field start to cross the line now um, Scott wanted the podium so much uh, Harrison finished the race uh, if he didn't finish if he didn't pick again Harrison he would have made it to the end of the line um, by beating a few other cars uh, that are well known in here And Harrison oh. is not bottom. <laughs> oh man. And that is the race that we're just waiting for both of Harrison's cars to come across the line here in 30th and 31st. Um, yeah. What a race that was. What a, what a, what a day for both GP oh. for this. And uh, wow. So that is the opening round done, guys. Let's have a look at the championship standings which I think Liam will actually be very proud of. Let's go for the driver's sand. Oh driver oh, hasn't even updated all of them yet. Okay that's weird. Okay, it has updated the driver's sand so let's have a look and see who is leading in the drivers. BC actually uh, it's going to be the same for results as well. BCP 25 points for Perez then Yossi with 18 and 15. Then you've got Rapid Scorpion Scott with fourth with 12 points a with 10 points in the opening round. Falcon with 6. Keep racing 7. BCP uh, with 4. Uh, Knife again to keep racing 2. And Rapid takes the last remaining points of the of the points playing position. Team Sandins. Yoshi. 33 points compared to Rob's 29. Then you've got Nent. I wouldn't believe I'm saying it's Rapid. Or Scott is ahead with 30 points with Liam three points behind him. The battle of the commentators have begun, everyone. Keep, keep Racing and Falcon are tied with eight points. Then seventh all the way down to sixteenth with zero points. And the bottom three, well, they've got to worry. And I'm definitely worrying right now because the bottom three at the end of the season will move down to the Sandley Cup and I'm not I have no intention to go down there. So, so it seems uh, Liam is currently in forward in the sand and so far he is pretty much happy. I think he's so happy he's gone silent. No, no, I'm here. Oh you are here. I got me some music. No, I never thought I'd see this day <laughs> It's just, it's waiting. It's coming. Okay. 
<laughs> this is like a championship win to me, no one understands. <laughs> It, 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 it takes a while. Okay. <laughs> I'm sorry for the very bad audio as well from Liam's uh, microphone. <laughs> <laughs> No, that's a bad one. There we go. Everyone sing along. No, I don't want to deafen you with that, you know? That'll be for another day. I was jamming for that. If you look at me, <laughs> I'm jamming. Um, yeah, that is the end, wow, of an event for... I think that went pretty well. We've hit 20 people in a live stream, which I never thought I'd see the day to see that. And 26 cars separated by a second, which is absolutely crazy. Um, now to fire my driver. Um, Rapid uh, Scott is saying I'm changing the hypo. Simply wasn't quick enough compared to Jan. Uh, Dream says congratulations, Liam. We're all proud of you, man. Oh. And uh, Mark, <laughs> I shed a, a little tear for emotion of Liam's achievement. <laughs> God forbid I get a podium. If you get a podium next race, I will. I, I, I would say I eat my sock, but I'm not going to say that. Um, but you know, uh, Barney, celebrate, celebrate good times. Come on, da 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 da. And then Harrison says, Liam's music and many overly ma manly tears were shed. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh this is the most emotional I've ever been. I, I love this. I love this, guys. I absolutely love this. Oh man, I, I, I still can't believe we we hit 20 at one point and pretty much averaging about 19 people throughout the live stream so I thank you all so much um, tomorrow Malaysian IGP very high tire wear I believe uh, yes yeah, very high tire wear so Yoshi if you think about doing a soft soft and you still put it off I am taught I'm getting you on Skype on Saturday if you pull off a soft soft Man, oh man. Anyway, um, but yeah, I th I think we can. Uh... <laughs> um, Rapid just found another driver. His name is Rosberg. <laughs> um, but yeah, uh, <laughs> man, this has been successful, Liam. Don't you think? I this has been has. very successful. I think it's just drawn in such a new crowd as well, and it's just it adds that extra bit of like pre pre race tension, if you will, doesn't it? Because it gives the guys in the big league a chance to maybe try and change their strategy a bit before the deadline and see if they can maybe actually you know softs won't work or hards won't work there. Maybe go for an intermediate like we saw earlier, mm. and it just really does add something more to the broadcast. I think definitely. Um, Rob just said, "I won three championships. Is that not enough for one Skype call?" We'll get you in tomorrow then. We'll have a, a nice little party. We'll get you in and maybe get Tim in. Uh, because he's in the actual Stanley Cup. So, yeah. That sounds like a good idea. Um, so that should be pretty decent. Uh, Harrison, we've had Minardi blood running through Harrison's racing veins. That means i got to turn out a brilliant team at the end of that, I believe. Uh, Alice, race results traditional. Uh, Dream, my last, my last name is bad in Croatia or whatever your, your language is. Hmm. Um... But yeah, like I said, this has been a fantastic uh, opening round, and we've got the next one tomorrow. Um, I probably will have to say sorry to my flatmate next door, because I think she's in her room, and I did shout quite a bit. Um, <laughs> also apologise to the whole of my avenue for definitely. <laughs> <laughs> um, Dina said, Liam, you should try and get Highfeld. Um, no, I've already gone for a driver, and I've gone for a woman. Oh, taking a, a leaf out of my book then. I did, and she's Finnish as well, so you've got like a really cold woman, not like in that sense, but you know, like cool, a Kimi Raikkonen cool. female version. Okay. And um, but yeah. tomorrow it's meant to be overcast, so it could rain, so anything could be possible. Um, but this has just got a lot, lot more competitive now. Oh, muzz oh wow, muzzlement, ninety-one percent parts. Follow him. What? Copy him. 
Oh wow, I gained so much from Azimuts as well. I'm copying him badly right now. I've just got Sim to piss out on my shashi. Brilliant! <laughs> <laughs> I'm loving that already. Um, hopefully I can get 31st. Oh, that, that would just help entirely. Right. But yeah. Um, but I don't think there's anything else. I think. Um, yeah, how much did I get? I gained 24% on his shashi. Ha <laughs> oh, I'm copying Muslims right now. I'll be back in the championship probably next week <laughs> with that. Um, um <laughs> Oh man. Right. Again, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you for making this stream very, very successful. One of the successful streams I've ever had. Um does mean so much to me uh, and Liam also um, you know just to have this and have our own little community growing ever so slowly um, but yeah that that's brilliant I've got nothing else to say apart from uh, uh, thank you and Barney said no Tom no lol <laughs> And Dom, everyone figured out now how well his parts are. And now Dominic's saying, "Oh, Barney, you liar!" So I'm sorry, I'm sorry, Barney. I made a guess and I got it right. I knew there was a reason why he was as a performing last season, and you were focusing all on next season. So you're not getting that, and everyone knows that now. Um, quick tip to any new guys, um, any new guys watching the streams as well, either if you're in the Stanley or in the Jenkins Cup, go and watch uh, a couple. Like I've got another two or three videos of Malaysia, so if you want to go check that out and see what kind of strategy works out, then feel free to. Especially last season, I think it was quite interesting last season. So any of you guys that are brand new, um, you know, looking to actually see see what strategies are, you can have a look there. And also you got the GP2 race beforehand. I'm okay, gonna just call it GP2, <laughs> apart from Sandy now. Um, so you got that also. But I don't think you got anything to say, have you, now, Liam? I'm just blown for words, honestly. I mean, the fact that we had, like, 20 viewers at some point is just brilliant, you know. Mm. I think you summed it up perfectly. But it's just so nice to see this growing as well and such a nice and respectful community. And it's just so much banter all the time as well. <laughs> and to have that, then the support race, which was great in itself. And even when you're not racing, you can still feel the tension and the drivers getting really into it and everything. So that was awesome. And then for me to score points as well, I'm honestly over me with this stream. So thank you so much to everyone for tuning in and making all this possible, really. I I'm not happy. <laughs> I'm not oh, I'm beating you in the championship for the first time yes, ever. Yes, you are beating me in the championship. Don't I'm taking me. a picture on my phone. Hang oh, on. no. He's going to tweet it out now. <laughs> oh, I've no. never... You're never going to let me down with this. Just in case you, yeah. you know, you win the championship, all these are the only points I score. Oh, no. Just know that at one stage, you were losing to me. <laughs> Oh man, yeah, every, everyone's going mad in the actual forums as well. Um, you got odd saying, 91% Bonnie, you liar. <laughs> <laughs> There's no way. Uh, it's not my, hey, I guess right guys who I was spying on, but I think everyone now uh, will be spying on him. But to consider him, he didn't, I don't think he even got any points. No, he didn't, I don't think. No. So he should spy on me. Full Throttle didn't <laughs> do it, so, you know. Um, but everyone knows now. Who it is? Uh, what parts are scorpions? Oh, that'd be interesting. But we'll find out tomorrow. Actually, see what happens. But I'm going in it there, guys, because I need a drink, and it, it, it'll teach me a lesson to bring a drink up next time. <laughs> um, yeah, I could, again, I can't say enough. Thank you for tuning in. Thank you for all 20 viewers that actually was, um, you know. Um, in in the actual section uh we've still got 14 people watching now so that's thank you for just me we have been on um at the end after and i hope to see you all tomorrow for round two of the igp league for the sanding cup and then the big boys turns of the jenkins cup so for me and liam thank you for watching guys you've been watching us at the home at racing and i hope to see you all tomorrow so there's been f1 i'll see you later guys <laughs>